They found my spy! Vengeance is near! What to do, what to do? Alright, you're gonna keep like going this way, I guess, so I'll just keep coming. Annihilate. You're just gonna keep pathing along as well. Keep going this way. Master. I think I've already been to both these shops here, so... And it's like, sort of like a waste of magic to do this, but you know. Pop. Is there anything in this shop? So that's this orphs in here, apparently I don't really care about that stuff. Yeah, when you're too busy to like, you know, sending you basically up there, you just like summon something, right? Oh, this guy has potions, I guess, are goodbye. I got the money to buy stuff, by the way, so if I want to, I could do so. Master. I'm not sure I really need the potions, though. We got plenty of, like, you know, restoration potions here, just stuff here as well. I can't quite get over there, unfortunately, but, you know, whatever. Just go in here, I guess. Near. Let's get you up here. Whoops! Well, apparently I've got two yesterdays because if the other one is my callus that basically died, so whoops! Oh well, that's fine. Alright, think about things here. I'm just wondering if, like, you know. Is there any like shops that basically want to visit is the thing, right? So well, I'm being called, so it's gonna check my phone. This might just be real quick though, so. Nope, I have to take this one, so be right back.
Uh. All right, let's look at this, I guess. Interruptions, interruptions, you know, but whatever. Actually, I have guys right here, but whatever. There's some scrolls I can buy, I'll probably just get them. You know what? I have the money, so just grab them. And while we're at, let's have you go up here. You'll just get that. Was there anything at this one, I wonder? Alright, well. <laughs> we'll despawn all our sums, I guess, because, you know, that has to happen. Alright, so we're basically the master of this world at this point because, like, you know, everything else is dead. Literally. Let's fight these giant spires up here for the sake of it, I guess, so... Let's hit him in the face. Oh, I see him. Bad miss, but whatever. And yeah, this guy's basically gonna attack this guy up here. I wonder if this guy, like, primary of, like, my hero and, like, this guy here, because this guy's gonna, like, attack, like, the Phantom Warrior, but whatever. Well, we're done. And I must go after this guy up here. A little bit of healing for this guy up here. You need to keep coming down, so keep coming down. Master. Just go up and grab that for me. My prince. Anything. Master. Alright, clean up shop. Uh Potion of Fortune. Do I actually have a benefit from this, I wonder? I know at this point, I'm more if I actually have like all the benefits of my guys here. And yeah, we actually have like, you know, this guy already having a benefit to hit, so... He can already hit things, basically. So I guess I'm one of these guys is like the main thing I just want to do here, so... There we go, this guy's a little more like capable of hitting stuff. They will suffer. Why am I even buying this stuff? Kill it, be done of it. Alright, well, we are done up here, so. Move along this way. What? Master. I'm gonna grab this. Your desire. Plant this raw and be done of it. Master. Let's get you moving. Oh, I just ran past this guy. I probably could give him a scroll right there, but oh well. Annihilate. Let's go like this, I guess. Let's get you over here. Master. Master. 
know, I think what I'm going to do basically right now. We'll grab these scrolls like this. What? Well, let's go like this with like, you know, or Sania. This uh, like ferries over a little bit. We're at that point where I'm basically about to win, really, so... I just want to basically like, have my ducks in a row. Who gets guy like the, like, you know, stuff over here. So, boom, all the scrolls basically on my, like, you know, mage to do with. Master. By the way, I love these guys that's like, you know, sort of there to be, like, sort of stop gaps, more or less. These, like, you know, parties here. They're not really here to fight, so to speak, just to, like, you know, um, ball up, like, the elves when they attack me. And they are going to attack me, by the way, in a moment. Basically what's going to happen here, we're going to attack these guys, and they aren't going to like it too much. The elven lands are before you. You must rid the land, its queen. Destroy her. They will suffer. So here we go. And I'll bow. One pop. That's done. What? Get you over here, I guess. Annihilate. And you guys go right there. Anything your desires. Ah! Yes, master. You know, I should probably just pop these guys with, like, you know, golems and stuff like that, because they're kind of just annoying, so. Alright, so not for it. We have entered the Elven City, Master. The Elves are well versed in the practice of magic. Advance with caution. We meet at last, Undead. You will pay dearly your intrusion in our lands. I will punish you for your evil you spread through the lands. And how will you achieve this, godless race? We have more tips behind us. We will prevail again. I will need no god to rid the land of you. My sorcery will be sufficient. I will destroy it myself, Talendriel. Have no fear. So yeah, we got attacked by the way, so... That's annoying. Oh, you know what? This guy's gonna, like, you know, heal up these guys like crazy, so... All it basically does is, like, kills off, like, that archer there. Well, that's annoying, but whatever. Um... I basically avoid this area because there's like lots of triggers and stuff like that to worry about, so I want to be triggering like everything if I could, so. Oh, that's annoying. These are all, uh, guys are all like really high power um, level at this point, so. Master, they will suffer. Everything hurts basically. Pop him. They will suffer. Pop him. Okay, let's try this again with like the golem. We're just gonna have him like, you know, pop these like centaurs. So pop. Alright, well, this is like not really being helpful to me because like, you know, we're slowing these guys up and making more more powerful to deal with, so... Here's all my spells, by the way! I have these, I can use them on things! So I'll drop that on him, basically... I just want like an area effect type of damage, so let's just drop Death Storm here. Do that right there.
There's chain lightning. Well, we cut off the forest elf, that's useful. You know, I'm telling you to just kill off everything because I don't want to deal with like, these like centaurs, so. We'll just keep dumping spells on them until they, like, you know, just die. It's in a rock basically to finish him off. There we go. Why not attack this guy over here? We'll attack this guy first, I guess, so... Hit you in the face. Well, we got at least one Paralyze off there. That still hurts a lot, though. Hooray! Level up for the Shade. And here's where I start dumping potions on these guys, just so like, you know, keep going here. They will suffer. Alright, this should get a lot easier this time because like, you know, we now have access to like, you know, um, my hero basically killed this guy here, so just wait. Ow, 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 wait, wait. Alright, now we go like this. And this. So watch you like you know does a quick heal but pop pop and there we go they're dead and basically like, in here is like a bunch of like elves we have to basically fight all these guys in here by the way so lots of fun basically happening soon My prince. stop gaps come come up here. Die. Yes, the Starcrafts are coming. What? Who must die? Anything. Your desires. <laughs> Master. See, yes, everything's going to attack me now. But whatever. Uh, hit this guy. Honestly, I probably should have like, gone for this guy up here, but whatever. Give that elf. We'll paralyze him. Hit you in the face. Ow. Well, we gotta revive him now. Kill off him so he can't hurt my phantom warrior down here. Bro, is that Griffin? Yes, the elves will attack you. And they hurt a lot. They will suffer. Let's kill off this one then. There we go. They will suffer. Let's kill off these ones. She's got an Oracle health, so she'll be a little more like dangerous, but whatever. Ow. Ow. Defend. I'll 
take that paralyze. And we're done. Love the first shade again. Your desires, precious lord, annihilate my prince. What? So everyone gets over here. Vengeance is near. Master. Who must die? All right. Well. If I recall, um, basically the, the queen is basically up in like you know this direction up here. So, let's map this out a little bit. Who must die? So two sky lords and a central lancer base over here to deal with. So that'll be fun. Let's just kill off him. I'm, te I'm tempted to make these guys defend for now, actually, so... Well, let's just paralyze. If I can. Hooray! No damage at all now, because, like, you know, we paralyzed them. Take that paralyze right there. gonna wait. We're gonna get lots of good experience basically if these guys survive this, so there's a little 10 like you know Phantom Warrior. Massive damage to these guys now basically. They will suffer. I guess kill this guy right here. I'm gonna look if he's paralyzed this because like you know They can't do anything he's like you know Skylar's right paralyzed Wait wait Yay not level ten like you know Phantom Warrior Note these guys back here are like a lot weaker because so they take a lot more experience to level up than like these guys, but you know. They also heal up my guys, so there's that going for us as well. Shade's level 14, so. Chance of Palace is like 57%. Um, 7 what? Alright, so basically up here is Salandriel. She's got a blue dragon first, she's got basically herself, an elf lord, and oracle elf, so. Nothing like, you know, too snazzy, but she's snazzy enough. Master, your desires are not Alright, I think once we go through this gate, we have like a, a, you know, sort of like a boss, like, you know, encounter to go with, so we're just gonna save her here with the boss. Just in case. I want this to get the stuff basically like over here, by the way, so. You have desecrated a sacred earth course, men. We are obliged to defend ourselves and destroy you. We stab the elves. Unite our forces against the abominations. Today you guys all turn empire, by the way. To me, dragons, I call upon you once more to save the elves. They all turn like, you know, empire. Well, that's nice and all, but, um... We're gonna go this way. I mean, I messed up there a little bit, but that's fine.
Now here's where it's important to sort of like, you know, knock down these guys' movement because like, you know, they're going to chase us. So... We're just going to do this to them. And make them nice and slow. They might attack us, these guys, which will suck, but you know, if they do, then like, you know... We're just going to do this to them, I guess, for the most part. Oh, they didn't move. Probably because the Empire is dead, I guess, but whatever. Alright, so over here we got ourselves a couple like blue dragons and this guy right here, so it will be fun, but whatever. Let's kill him off before he does anything to us. Kill us that dragon. Kill us that dragon. It was that dragon. Yes, when even dragons like fall before you like nothing, so there we go. Level up for those guys back there. And close enough for him as well. The Banner of War. Basically I want this for like the extra like you know damage I basically get from it, so we put this on, get a little bit like a, of a damage boost. Alright, now I don't, I don't think these guys are moving because like the Empire is dead. That's the only reason like they're not moving, not moving around. So, there's that basically like, nope, but whatever. Let's just get a golem to sort of like, you know, wipe out some of these stuff over here, I guess. So, all about all. Level some rules, by the way, over here. I know probably the only thing I really have to do is like kill off her, so I'll probably just like just aim to do that, but you know, whatever. Master. These guys are sort of in a way too, is a thing, right? So. I'm probably send Valkyrie in here to sort of like soften these guys up a little bit, so... Let's do that. All the experience these guys are getting, you know, but whatever. Pop! Pop! There's something I don't have to deal with now. I don't know if I'm really serious about like killing these guys off, all I have to really do is like, you know, just drop spells like left on right on so... We'll just drop that dragon right there a little bit. Drop some of this stuff on him.
Almost got him. Uh, let's save his Tempest for like the Green Giants at this point. There's a little bit of mind damage to drop. Let's go for a little lightning damage on, um, not this guy, but these guys. A little blizzard on him. Those guys are dead. A little bit of fire damage, maybe. There goes the Oracle Elf. Yeah, basically it's like wiping out like the like, you know, the the weaker guys basically in these parties, so I don't have to heal them. Oh, it's immune. They're dead. Yeah, all the spells I can cast, right? Just as a ton of them, so... This is what happens when you just have, like, you know, all the resources in the world sort of drop on stuff. You can drop everything on them. They're still alive, technically, but, you know, I should be able to wipe them out, so that's fine. Actually, let's just, like, do this. I still have a summon I can drop on these guys, the Hellhound. Oh, they have enough health that they're going to withstand this attack, I think, so... That was not beneficial to me at all, but whatever. Let's kill a few. So, pop. Ow. Pop. Pop. Did he just level up now? Or was he already level up? I can't remember. Well, that's done. You know, just be on the safe side, I'm just gonna cast a couple, like, you know, quick spells on these guys to make sure, like, you know, if they get attacked by, like, stuff, they're not gonna, like, you know, take too much damage. So, you know, great chance to hit. Armor. They don't seem to be attacking me, but, you know, just in case they do. And they aren't, so that's fine. There they go. They will suffer. It's this guy over here. We're just basically cleaning up all the experience to make myself a little bit more powerful for as very as boss, I guess. Do 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 do. Ow. Ow. You know it was actually bad for me to hit these guys, so let the vampires hit them. I can actually use healing spells if I want to at this point, so hooray! Heal up a little bit.
Probably a bit of waste doing this, but let's just send this guy over here to attack these guys. I assume it's going to raffle stop here for a golem there, but whatever. Oh, he doesn't take that much to level up this guy. I gotta watch out for that. Who must die? Oh, we did get attacked by like this like part over here, so it's gonna hurt like my shade quite a bit. Kill off him. She'll pull through, but it's gonna hurt a lot for sure. Okay, we're fine. She'll live. Let's see here. Let's drop off. Down on her. Yeah, I'm just sort of picking apart everything here, but you know, whatever. Smack. Ow. Ow. You're gonna wait. Ouch, you're gonna wait. Bad miss there, but whatever, I can take it. Alright, let's just drop our healing potion on this guy here. Or two. And you. I've like drawn this out long enough, I guess, but you know, we're just gonna fight this like, you know, final fight here. So who needs like the extra accuracy, I guess? Probably you. And you need extra protection. You guys need extra protection. You don't, so you're fine. I doubt that initiative is going to really help her, but you know, why not? Let's give her a little bit more initiative. I forgot to use all these potion of like fire war and stuff like that, but whatever, it's fine. Massive accuracy boost for her. Now, I'm not really sure, but does this guy benefit from like, actually damage at this point? He's got 214, like, you know, add here. After some point, I think these guys, like, you know, damage they max out, so. Yeah, he's at maximum damage by, like, you know, hero here. He can't benefit anymore from, like, extra damage, so. It makes more sense, basically, for him to, like, you know, not get anything else, and these guys just to get maxed on their damage instead. Alright, so, here's the big time, where you go buff, 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 so, increase the damage. And we'll decrease initiative. Damage. I can do this as well, so drop a spell on them. Alright, she's got basically an orc off a blue dragon elf lord, so... Softening them up is like always a good idea. Uh, great chance to hit, that's always good to get. More armor. We'll get some damage on them again. Let's get some great chance to hit here. We'll drop this on them.
I was if I did enough damage to, like, you know, wipe out these guys over here. Almost. I thought I could kill him with, like, a golem, by the way, but, you know, it's fun to look at him and see, like, how much damage it did to him. Right, then the boss needs to get focused down, so let's keep focusing stuff on her. Let's keep on dropping spells on her. So many spells. And you know what? I still have more spells to cast because I got the scrolls after like this on the mage as well, so we're still not gonna be done. This is probably overkilling it, by the way, for, like, defeating her, because, like, you know, we're dropping everything and anything on her. Alright, that seems to be, like, all it for that, so... They will feel my power. We'll boost up our, you know, things here a little bit. Uh, these won't be benefit me at all, but why, why not? We'll start with on these guys here. There's War Ward. There's an Ice Shield where we cast that, but you know. It's there. Blizzard. There's Ice Storm. Oh, I did that one, so... That only works, I think, on, like, herself, so... That actually won't, like, benefit anyone else, so... Whatever. Um... There's a big one. They basically damage him. Let's back that one on him, I guess. How many spells do I have left? Alright, that looks to be like it. I've actually like, you know, gone and like smashed this guy with like everything I basically had there. Uh, yeah, we basically like, you know, crippled her a little bit, as well as her dragon. This guy's like almost dead over here as well. You know, I just feel like doing it just for the sake of doing it, so... Let's see if I just, like, you know, take these guys out with summons. Ow. This is what a damage rate done right there. I use the weak ones first, probably, to try and finish off the centaur, so... See if I can pull that off.
There we go. Well, all these guys have, like, you know, high initiative, so... There's that, but whatever. Bam. Yeah, I'm not gonna level up from this, but you know. I also see if a nightmare can take out that guy as well, so. I don't think I'll be able to kill off everything on the map, but you know. We'll cough all but spot um, this like Skylord here, I guess. So, you know, he's there, but whatever. Alright, I won't bother with, like, you know, Master. the ant basically trying to kill him or the blow, but so let's go after this guy. They will suffer. Alright, so I'm not this point after like all our bus by the way. Here's like the boss right here, by the way. So rule of the Elven Kind, Elf Queen, Telindriel, Liam, protects her, her brothers with her A of her dragon mount. No, not much. I basically reduce like her ability to do anything. She's got like no armor. She has this much reduced damage. This much reduced initiative. And like her friend here basically has like reduced damage and initiative as well. And then all my guys over here basically have like you know super damage, 100% chance to hit, 60 armor. Same with this guy over here. This guy's a little lower of like the damage, but you know this guy's the potion and stuff and, uh, and you know stuff like that. She's basically got like 100% 100% chance to hit, even though she's like a shade, so that's insane. 60 armor on her. This guy's got max damage. She's got 100% chance to hit. Far higher initiative than like you know um, the you know lady right there. My guy basically this initiative, his chance to hit and stuff like that. I right, let's get this underway. So bang, one shot, one kill. How overpowered was it? Was I pretty full overpowered? But whatever. And there's our banner four two for killing her, so we get like less damage from attacks based with that. Light potions, healing ointment. Tier of purity. Lear wearing his helm is unaffected by thieves, but whatever. Elf lord, boots of the elements. How? How could you defeat me? Selenial is truly dead. Our gods have forsaken us. It was Mortis's desire, elves. Selenial is no more. Forgive me, my children. I can protect you no more. It is time to revive Mortis's consort. Prepare the ceremony. Alright, so the mission is complete. The mission has been successfully completed. You can export any of your leaders and equipped items to import them later in quests or in custom sagas. Export leaders now, yes. So we're gonna basically, um, you know, export him with this, like, you know, massive six hundred eight like battles one. Your son has been safe with all um, with his equipped items, and we're not gonna worry about these guys here. So whatever, it's fine. You know, I probably should actually like check these equipped items, but whatever. The Walking Dead defeated Taladriel, the Elven Queen, and the ritual to revive Galleon could finally begin. The hideous troops were to witness the rebirth of Mortis's fallen consort. Alright then, so... Continue. The sun rose at night, and from it Galleon was reborn. From the infinite, Galleon had gazed long at these lands, helplessly contemplating the chaos and evil Mortis had unleashed. The Elder God eyed Mortis with disdain, and then disappeared, unable to forgive her the terror she had sown in the world, and in the hearts of his elven children. Mortis's rage grew when her ungrateful mate vanished and spurned her eternal love. 
She could not comprehend how he could abandon her again. She could not see what she had become. Alright, das ends the Undead Saga. See, yeah, I don't know if I want to like load up my guys basically for like you know next quest and stuff like that. So, when I get around to, we'll basically do like the like you know Undead's like you know other like campaign, the like you know Servants of the Dark. No, but we actually have to import a leader here, so we have to like you know import like Kersani here, and well, I guess we do have access to the Banner of War, so we have like more damage inflicted, so he's not gonna be terrible, but you know. Having reduced damage probably would have been better to like, you know, bring around, but whatever. He's gonna be powerful enough, I guess. I mean, he's gonna hit like a truck at least. Alright, so. That'll be for like, you know, another like time. We basically have gone through this campaign. It took me long enough to go through it. I hope you guys basically enjoyed like the show of it and um Hope to see you again when we basically get to like Servants of the Dark, because I plan to do that as well, but you know. Well, this is stuff I want to record, so I'll get to that first.